Good morning, saints. Today is Tuesday, January 23rd, 2024. My wish list for 2024. One of my wishes is that God would so prick us, so convict us, the older generation, that we would begin to do more mentoring of the younger generation. Bridge the gap. Mantle the generation. Help them to understand how conflicts ought to be resolved. Help them to understand how to live godly lives. Help them how to navigate life's challenges. In the book of Titus chapter 2, beginning at verse 2. Lead the male elders into disciplined lives full of dignity and self-control. Urge them to have a solid faith, generous love, and patient endurance. Likewise, with the female elders, lead them into lives free of gossip and drunkenness and to be teachers of beautiful things. This will enable them to to teach the younger women to love their husbands, love their children, be self-controlled and pure, taking care of their household and being devoted to their husbands. By doing these things, the word of God will not be discredited. Verse 6, likewise, guide the younger men into living disciplined lives for Christ. Saints, we have dropped the ball. Too many of us have become self-centered. Too many of us are only worried about our relatives. But God is calling us to mentor the next generation. Oh my God, as we look around in our country, as we hear the news every day, isn't your heart pricked? I know mine is. I'm looking for opportunities. I'm listening to the Lord. Lord, how many more do you want me to help? I presently, I am mentoring about seven young people, male and female, because there is truly a shortage of male mentors. But God is going to hold us accountable, saints. Each of us should have a mentor. Each of us should have a mentee. God pricked the hearts of the people. That's my wish this year. Pricked our hearts to impact the next generation. In Jesus' name, amen.